at the city. Sonsonate, Sonsonate, the weather is very, very hot. Very, very hot. hot. Very hot. Hello, very. teacher. Hi, good evening. Hi, teacher. How are you today? Fine, fine. And fine. You? <laughs> I'm doing great. I thought you said you were not going to be in class, Carolina. Yeah. Uh, uh, what? I thought, you, I thought you said you were not going to be in class. Ah, okay. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. It was not you. Hold on. I confused it. Uh, it was Roxana. No, never uh, mind. <laughs> I thought you were not going to be in class. Have you guys studied? Okay. Uh, the chair, yeah. you know, my name is Difference. It's uh, a, she's name is Anna. <laughs> it's Anna. No, so, oh, yeah. really? Anna, okay. But I don't know why the... Soprovia parece ruso. <laughs> no, it, it sounds like a brand or it's, something. It's a brand, yes. Uh -huh. Like, like Soprovia is the, the company. <laughs> the company, the name of the company. The company. <laughs> yes. Ah, what company? What do they do? What do they do? What is that company <laughs> about? Soprovia is. Um, Construction. Uh, oh, well, it's a laboratory about the study the soil and material for construction. Okay. No, I never heard of it. What's the mother teacher? With what? You cannot hear me, or what happened? Um. Can you hear me now? Yes. All right. What are you asking me, Mauricio? Uh, yes, teacher. You ask me something? Se oye interferencia, teacher. Se oye cortado. Ah, okay. No, I don't know. I'm using my internet. Okay, let's get started. So, um, before we continue, do you have any questions about the past? Yes, past simple and verb regular and irregular verb. Okay, let me see. The can you see my screen? Okay, with yeah, irregular um, verbs, with irregular verbs, uh, what you have to do is you have to memorize the list. Okay, I'm going to send the link with the verbs and the pronunciation so you can practice, okay? But there's no other option. Okay, with irregular verbs, uh, you know that we simply add ed, right? And there are three different ways to pronounce that. I may review that later with you because I uh, we studied that in previous modules. Okay, this is with, sorry, regular verbs. Okay. Um, Study was and where to be and pass. Yeah, we're going to practice actually was and where, and we're going to do that right now. Let's review the structure before we we start. Okay. So when study. are we going to when are we going to use was, guys? Was is a I he she it, and uh, where is yes. a you they we. You, they, we. we. You, they, we. You, they, we. All right. And this is? Neg negative form wasn't. Weren't. Weren't. Uh-huh, exactly. Yeah, that's the, that is the, uh, the, the abbreviation of it, the contraction of it. But it's not necessary to use it, okay? So what is important to highlight here is that this is not an auxiliary, okay? This is Deal. one verb. Auxiliary. Deal. Deal. No, 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 Deal. but we're going to oh, focus right question. now. Hold on, let me explain, guys. Okay. One second. All right. So what's important to keep in mind is that this is not an auxiliary right now, all right? This is one verb. How many verbs do we have? 
we have many verbs, like hundreds of verbs, right? This is one verb, that's about it. The problem is when you think that this is an auxiliary to, to speak in the past, but this is simply the past of the verb what? The past of be. the verb be. be. Exactly. Be. I be. thought you were not going to be in the group. Fernando, there you are. I haven't seen Roberto. Uh, hi, teacher. How are you? Hi, nice seeing you again. I thought you were not joining this time or something. Okay. Well, it is the past of the verb to be. Okay. Uh, quickly, let's make one example in the affirmative, negative, and interrogative form. And then we're going to practice. Okay, so give me an example in the affirmative form, Franklin. Did. You're muted, Franklin. Okay, well, someone else. Uh, Monica. I was I was born in San Salvador. Yes, that's I was born in San, San Salvador. Salvador. Great. And negative, I wasn't born in San Salvador. I wasn't born. Wasn't born in, in San, San Salvador. Salvador. And question. What would be the question form, Diana? Was I? Hold on. I will ask people in, in particular, right? So that everybody okay. can participate. But thank you. Okay, Diana, what where is the question you, form? Where were you born? Mm, you know, that is right. Or where, this is where were you born? It's okay. But this is information question. What is the yes or no question, Fernando? Uh, did you born in San Salvador? Okay. Although we're trying to use was and were only, all right? The verb uh -huh, be. Uh -huh. That's it. Okay. So look, this is affirmative, negative, and information question. Remember that we usually switch the position, right? Mm -hmm. So we need a yes or no question, Fernando. You can do it. Yes or no question. Um, the switch the was position. Where first born? Hold on, let Fernando try. Hold on. Was where first? Mm -hmm. Hold on, hold on. Where, I'm waiting for Fernando. Where, Go ahead. Were you, were you born in San Salvador? Exactly. That's what it is. And the answer would be what? Yes or no? <laughs> yeah, yes, but I the was born. Yes, yes, I was. I was born. No, yes, I was. That's it. Oh, yes, I was. Okay. Right. And no, I, I wasn't. wasn't. I wasn't. Okay. That's about it. All right. So basically, um, we switch the position when we're asking a question, right? Let's do one more example with with where. Okay, let me see. Rina, help me out, please. We're gonna say the students to make it plural, okay? So, the students. Rina? The students were in the class. The students were in class last night, let's say, okay? And you know what? To make it a little bit better, the majority of students were in... No, no, no. That would make it singular, so never mind. The students were in class last night. Okay, negative form of this. Diana? You're muted. Sorry. Uh, the students weren't in class last night. Uh -huh. The students weren't. Yeah, guys, don't pronounce this E, okay? Weren't. But weren't. Right, weren't. Weren't in class. Weren't. Weren't. Weren't in class. Weren't. Yeah. Don't weren't. pronounce this E. Yes. Weren't. 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 Uh, Wilson? Excuse me? What is the no, question, no question form? The, no, the, the yes or no question form for this specific sentence. No, no understand the, the, the question. Oh, how would you ask the question? 
All right, Mauricio, go ahead. Were the student in class last night? Uh huh. So we switched the position, right, of the verb mm -hmm. be in the past. Were the students the student. in class last night? Very good. I understand. Okay, so tell me something, guys. Everybody studied the verb be for many times, many times, right? For a long time in school, yes. in, in the academy, and so on. Okay, this is identical. Yes. This is exactly the same, okay? The only exception is that in, this is the verb be is in the past now, but the structure is the same. So that's important to keep in mind, all right? Is that clear? If you, okay, let's put this in the present form. I don't want to confuse you, but I think that you can take it. So the students are in class. The students are not in class. Are the students in class? Yes, they are. So everything is the same. What you're substituting is the verb be for was and were. It's the same, okay? So what is an information question here, Guadalupe? You don't know? No. Information questions are what, when, why, who, so on. Um, question or no an information where, question. Where I will ask students? who said that? Diana? Okay. Uh, where were the students um, last night? Well the majority were in class, right? <laughs> the majority was in class. And the rest of them, I don't know. <laughs> so where were the students? <laughs> <laughs> last night okay are you okay are you ready to practice yeah do you have any teacher. questions no teacher no is it helpful for you knowing that the structure let's mute the microphone okay? mute the microphones okay is it helpful for you knowing that it's the same as the verb be I'm going to send you an image and that's the one we're going to practice. So for example, I'll give you an example of the practice, okay? We're going to say, who was your favorite? No, well, hold on, let me change it. What was your favorite cartoon when, I cannot see, hold on. When you were a kid. Okay, how would you answer that question? My favorite cartoon is... No, but this is in the past. Uh, it's a past. My favorite cartoon when I was a child... Was. When I was a child, cartoon was... Because, oh, the... the uh, what's the name? Flintstones, I think it is. Pass. Pass. Oh, when, yeah. so that when, is the Hold when on. I was my favorite okay. cartoon. My favorite yeah. cartoon was was the Flintstones. Yes, I don't know how to spell that though. <laughs> Let's say Looney Tunes, all right? Pink, the, Loon. the Pink Panther. Okay. The Pink Panther. Okay. Mas <laughs> <laughs> Messenger Z. The Flintstone. Yeah, I want to know the how. I think it's like oh, this. Very good, very good. <laughs> Flintstones, I think it was. I will check. I love the Flintstones when I was mm. little. <laughs> did everybody watch the Flintstones? Who didn't? And yes. <laughs> the Flintstone is amazing. Yes. Everybody, right? Yeah. Yes. yes. I don't know why yes. that was so popular and so good. Anyway, this is the structure. One more example, okay? And I'm sending you the questions right now to the WhatsApp group. So there's one question here that says, when was the last time? When was the last time you drank coffee? How would you answer this question, uh, Carolina? I was no, not, uh, you, not you. It says the last I, time. I was. Coffee. So say the last time. Ah, uh, the last time. 
uh, was, I was, no. I was, no, I uh, drink. drink. No, but drank, in the past. Drank, I drank coffee. Was here it is. Was okay. in in my lunch. Uh -huh. After my lunch, so in Pollo after, Campero. After lunch, a Pollo Campero. Okay, very good. <laughs> very specific. <laughs> yes, yes. Campero I, 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 I ate my lunch in a, in a, a popa. I was visiting customer all day. <laughs> well, <laughs> look at yes. this. Yes, yes, really. Excellent. Or or after I visited, hold on, after lunch. Yes. Yeah, yeah, while visiting a customer, that's good. So it is okay if you give complete answers. And you can also ask follow-up questions. Do you know what follow-up questions are? Follow-up questions. Follow -up questions is when you ask for more information. So imagine that I'm speaking with Carolina and she says, oh, the last time, oh, really? What were you doing in, in Apopa? I was visiting a customer and, and you, and so you start having a conversation, asking yeah. more questions than only the one there. Is that clear? Okay, so let's practice. Any questions? No. Any question? No questions. No. No, no. questions. All right, no. groups of three or in pairs, all right? So accept the invitation, everyone, please. And the questions are in WhatsApp. Click on accept. Join. Mauricio, Hector, accept the invitation, please. Marlene, Franklin. Marlene, accept the invitation, please. Hi. Hi, accept the invitation, please. Isaac, you too. Everybody's in groups already. Last uh, oh. when was the last time you went shopping? Shopping. <laughs> shopping, compra. Okay. In the <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, okay. When was the last shopping? When? I like the question. Uh, in my case, I was my last time um, in United States. Oh really? Many, 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 many store, many store. <laughs> I don't. In one month ago. Ooh. And you? Me. Yes. Uh, uh, the last time I traveled by a the in weekend. My last time, not the last time that I. In my room was on weekend on the weekend mm -hmm. uh, when was the last no when was the time you uh, the last time I was the last time mm -hmm. uh -huh, you last skip class uh, the last time oh the last time that I skipped that was um, I think never. What? I think I never. You never skip class. Skip class. Mm -hmm. So you do you get in all the classes, all your classes? Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. She's a good example to a role, a good role model. 
Okay. Yeah, that's uh -huh. great, Brina. Uh, yeah. Diana, when was the last time you went on a date? Mm, the last time I went on a date was mm, maybe last month or two months ago. And how did it go? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was, I don't know, it was kind of weird. Oh, really? Why? Yeah, because I, the conversation doesn't... Uh, Fast. Didn't. Um, doesn't... Uh, Didn't. Fast. In the past, the oh, okay. conversation didn't. Didn't, didn't, sorry, uh, didn't, uh, I don't know, didn't, didn't flow. Uh, didn't flow. Oh, <laughs> no. And you, Karina? <laughs> um, the last time I think was the last month, but that was weird too. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because the next day, that person told me something that I don't know was bad. Something you uh, didn't like. Oh no. Yeah. Okay. All right. Continue <laughs> speaking. I will go check on the others. See what they say Thank about you. this. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, only I make I make. Uh, Homework for the university. <laughs> I, I did homework. Yeah. I did. Yeah, remember homework. the verb is do homework. Yes, yes, I did homework so, yeah. uh, last weekend. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Um, Anna, uh, when was the last time you cleaned your room? I was the last, no, last, the last time, time. The last time. Mm -hmm. Clean my room. I clean my room today. Okay, you're gonna okay, say the last la última time vez que y en mi cuarto I fue. So the last time. Repeat. The last time I cleaned my room. The, la the last time I cleaned my room was what? yesterday. Uh huh. Yesterday. Excellent. Yeah, very good. Okay, great. Ask me a question. When was the time you like skip class? Okay, uh, teacher. Yeah. Uh, what the, do you, uh, how do you mean uh, skip? Skip class is Saltar. when you, mm -hmm. yep. also, meaning that okay. you were absent from class. Okay. Uh, I was scared uh, because I was scared in the afternoon when my, when, when our uh, selection <laughs> when you what? Perdió, ah, when, la, when you're the soccer, soccer, the soccer, soccer team, the soccer team, uh, <laughs> lawyer, los, no, al, los, yeah, yes, yes. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I understand. And when was? Okay, when was the last time you went forget about the the, the next the next, the next, ah, the next, one, the okay, next, next question. question Oscar when okay. was the last time you had a party Oscar I was in uh, the last time you had a party when was uh, okay. the last time you had a party I was in a party um Three months ago. Okay, and in your and case, you, uh, party. Uh, I don't know. When was the last time? In holidays, I think. In in, in uh, Christmas. 
Okay. It's At my treatment. last time. Yes. At in treatment. my case, the last time when I was in a party, the last was time a, I was in a party. I was in a party. Mm -hmm. Was a um, 24 hours for the beard, my daughter's birthday. Oof. Birthday. My daughter's birthday. birthday. So it, it was yesterday. Birthday. Birthday, repeat. Yes. Birthday. 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 Yeah. Birthday. Hi, are you, are you guys practicing? Gabriela, are you there? Hello, Gabriela. Isaac, can you hear me? Guys, you're supposed to be practicing. Isaac, are you there? Hello? Hi. Have you been able yeah, to talk I, to Gabriela? Okay, I'm gonna move you to a yeah, but group it's, then. It's a typical thing, uh, this normally with your way. Mm, yeah, that's true. Okay. Um, I'm gonna change you, right? So you can at least listen to what they're practicing. Accept the invitation, please. Gabriela, can you hear me? Unmute the microphone, please. Um, snake. A snake. A snake. Okay. okay. Uh, when was time you dance? You danced. Uh, money. <laughs> the last time I was, I no. The last time I danced was. Mm, two years ago, maybe. Thank you. And you? Uh, the last time I danced uh, in in birthday of my birth. was you didn't know who was the last time was 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 mm -hmm. yes the last time. Was the last uh, Hello. Maybe. Hi, I hear you. Gabriela is here. She's participating. Okay. Hola. Hello. Hello. You were Hi. Tenía su micrófono en, en mute. Lo tenía apagado. Oh. Okay, so ask a question. Can you hear me? Yes, now I can hear you. So you're going to participate, all right? Uh, Rina, can you ask Gabriela a question, please? Uh, okay. Gabriela, when was the last time you bought a CD? Uh, repeat, please. The questions are when, on the phone, Gabriela. I sent the questions to WhatsApp, but listen to her and answer. Mm. I don't. I don't know. Remember when? <laughs> it's the, you, the you last don't, time. You don't lost the money. <laughs> no. Okay. And, and don't be lose. careful. No. <laughs> don't lose the money. I don't lose. Don't lose the money. And okay. I am and, careful. Yes, because I'm careful. Uh -huh, exactly. Good job. Okay. Is Mr. Luis participating? Uh, yes, I, I have the question in Oscar. Ah, is there, it's you. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. The next question is for me. When was the last time you painted you about the world? <laughs> sure. 
que tú ah, quisiste... ¿Quise perder mi trabajo? No, perder el mundo. What no entiendo la pregunta. The last time you wanted to forget about the world. Mm -hmm. Like, ah. wanted to ah. escape. Oh. Ah, no, perder wow. el... Vacation. Olvidar. Olvidar. Yeah. Forget, olvidar. For, forget everyone. <laughs> the last time you wanted to forget the world and you make a part and, and go single. This is, this is the... the, the, the Forget the, not, not the single, but the, alone. Alone, alone. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. She's already single. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> alone, that was the word. Yeah. The correct word. Okay. So when was okay. it? So the last time uh, I wanted to forget about the world was when... Um, Uh, when uh, my grandfather dies and I really feel oh. so much because he oh. was the person that the make unity in the family right now the, the things are different because uh, he's, he's he's not anymore but that that is really 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 sad <laughs> yeah but that, that was the last time Sorry about that. Okay. Uh, yeah, usually you say when he passed away. Passed away. Okay, passed yeah. away. I'm sorry. Okay, that's okay. Thank you. Casi no se usa. They are rarely used. Rarely used. Uh, really rarely used. used. Mm -hmm. What? What are you talking about? What is regularly used? Uh, because of the question, when was the last time you borrow, borrowed? Borrowed the book. book. Uh, you borrowed the book. Uh, borrowed the book. The yes. last time I, the last time when I borrowed the book was. Yeah, you got it. Great. Years ago. <laughs> you got the structure. We're going to go back now. That was so interesting. <laughs> you can unmute the microphone. Mm -hmm. Okay, so did you practice? Yes, Listen. teacher. Yeah, it was interesting listening yeah. to what you were saying. Okay, yeah, and most of you, when I when I heard you, you were doing a good job. You were using the correct structure. So if I didn't say anything, it's because you were you were not making any mistakes. Okay, but you did great overall. Uh, let's read the objective, Tony. Tony Amaya. Here you are again. All right, read the objective for us, please. Can you guys see my screen? No, right? Okay. Hold on, hold on. No. Nope. Everybody access the platform. Okay, you should be on section 1.3. 1.3. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Tony, read, please. Okay. By the end of this class, you will be able to make positive and negative statement in the past tense using the verb to be additionality and you will be able to talk about your background in, in English for example explaining where you were born and when you come to the United States this English conversation is skills will help you introduce yourself and respond to questions using correct English grammar. That's a long objective. <laughs> okay, which you were doing already, but we're going to study it this time. We're going to watch a video, all right? 
Everybody pay attention, please. Mute the microphones and let's listen up. Hi, everyone. By the end of this class, you'll be able to make positive and negative statements. This video. Additionally, you'll be able to make statements such as, I was born in China. I wasn't born in the United States. Let me get started by quickly explaining this chart. First of all, what we're going to do is we're going to talk about this chart and we're going to quickly focus on the left side of this chart. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to learn how to make positive statements such as I was born in Argentina, how to make negative statements such as I wasn't born in, let's say, Mexico. The first thing that I would like to explain regarding this topic is one basic rule, and that's the birth to be. So let me, uh, let me get to that. What I want to do is explain the following concept, and that is that the birth to be will change depending on the pronoun that you use. For instance, whenever you use the pronouns I, he, she, or it, the birth to be that we're going to have to use for positive sentences is was. And whenever we make a negative sentence, then we're going to have to use wasn't. So if we look at our example here at the top, I was born in Argentina. Um, if I use another pronoun, let's say that I use the pronoun he, then I will say he was born in Argentina. If I were to use the pronoun she, then I would say she was born in Argentina. And obviously the same thing whenever we make a positive or negative sentence uh, with the um, other um, pronouns. So if I were to talk about we, then we will say something like, we were born in Argentina, um, you were born in Argentina, they were born in Argentina. Uh, so let me quickly explain, uh, you know, what the structure looks like. So in order to do that, we're going to have a subject plus uh, the verb to be in the past, and then we're going to have some sort of complement. So the example is, um, I was born in Argentina. Okay. And then what I want to say is I also want to give a negative statement. So I want to say I wasn't born in uh, China. This is the uh, first example that I gave you at the beginning. Um, and what I want to do at this time, I just want to quickly color that. I'm going to color the subject in red and I would like to color uh, the verb in green and then the complement. I'm just going to go ahead and color that in a different color. It could be any color. The only thing that I want you to notice is that uh, we have a subject at the beginning that follows the verb to be and then that follows some sort of complement in order for us to make the positive statements or the negative statements. So I mentioned that um, the subject we can change that to any subject that we would like. So for example, he, we could say he was born in Argentina. Uh, we could say she was born in Argentina. And also, I quickly want you to learn that you may also use names here. So for example, you may say Peter was born in Argentina, right? Uh, Mary was born in Argentina, and so on and so forth. Uh, and of course, if we want to make negative statements, then we would say something like this. Uh, he wasn't born in, Ar in China. Right? I was born in Argentina, I wasn't born in China. Whenever we change this subject, now we use you, so therefore we're going to have to use the verb to be where, and in our negative statements that would be weren't. So uh, you were born in Argentina, and of course we can say you and this will be in its negative form. So this will be, you weren't born in China. So what I would like for you to do now is to tell me in what part of the world were you born? And I want you to give me positive statements and negative statements about yourself. So for instance, let's say that you were born in Brazil. Well, then you will tell me something like, I was born in Brazil. And obviously, because you were born in Brazil, you weren't born in Argentina. So your statement could be, I was born in Brazil, I wasn't born in Argentina. Um, and I know there are students from different parts of the world, so maybe your statement could be, I was born in China, I wasn't born in Japan.
and perhaps your parents were born in France. So my parents were born in France. And I want you to make a negative statement with that. So they weren't born in, let's say, Spain. Okay. So I guess that with this explanation, it's a little bit better now, right? Clearer. Good grammar and spelling are important. But if you want to write... Sorry about that. Okay. <laughs> So uh, let's do the exercise. We're going to practice a little bit more with this. Okay, I'm gonna send you some questions, all right? Let me send them to you and I will explain how you're going to go about them. Okay, give me one. Use the microphones, please. Everybody muted. Okay, so the, the activity says this. It says, find someone who, guys mute the microphone please, who was at the beach yesterday. Okay, this is not a question, but you have to make it a question, all right? Guys mute the microphones please. So you have to make it a question, right? Okay. Um, what question are you going to ask? You're going to be in groups of three and you need to ask your classmates whether they were at the beach or not. How, how are you going to ask them? Um, Mauricio, what do you think? Mauricio, unmute the microphone. Okay. How would you ask Was... that question? Was at TV at TV yesterday? No, this is the question. You no, need to I... ask. You need to ask someone if they were at the beach yesterday or not. So, what question are you going to ask? It's a yes or no question using subject you. You're going to say. Uh, no, understand. Was you at the beach yesterday? Where? Where uh -huh. you? Were you at uh, the yeah. yesterday? So that means that you have to come up with the question. Where do you? You have to come up with the question, right? And the other person Sorry. will say yes, yes or no. Okay, so another question, okay. another one of them says, what's number two? Can you check it for me, please? Number two says, was at home all day yesterday, right? Hello. Guys, mute the was at home all day yesterday. Was okay. at How would you ask that question? Was at home all day yesterday. Yeah, how would you ask that question? So Was he at home all day yesterday? No, because you're going to ask directly. Were you, uh, were at, you home at home all day yesterday? Uh -huh. Were you at home? This okay. is the structure. Were you at home yesterday? Okay. okay. And yeah, maybe, yeah, you know what? It's a good idea if you ask. It's a good idea for you to ask, for example, was Juan Luis, that's a good idea actually, was Juan Luis at home yesterday? And then you ask, I don't know, I don't know. And then let me ask him, okay, let me ask him. And then you say, hey, Luis, were you are at home? Is that clear? You can ask both, was X person or were you? That's what you we're going to practice. Is that clear? Yeah? Yeah. Okay, let's practice because we only have 10 minutes. So I already sent the questions. Make questions and answer them, okay? So I accept the invitation, I will send it right now. Accept the invitation quickly, please. Let's practice.
Oscar, accept the invitation, please. And Anna, you too. Anna, accept the invitation, please. Hi, accept the invitation, please. Um, I have a long time. A long time. Uh -huh. so, <laughs> no, it's been a long oh. time. Ah, uh, it's been a long time. Yeah, since I last okay. went to the beach. Ah, uh, it's been a long time since I went. Since I last beach. went. Uh, to the I beach. Left, to the beach. Ah, to okay. the beach. Perfect. Excellent. Stressed. Yesterday. Yes, Where? I was hey. yesterday, today, and maybe tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> tomorrow. Yes, today, today, and tomorrow. Mauricio, you can ask, for example, Guadalupe eh, was Monica all day home yesterday. And then Mon Guadalupe asks Monica so that you can practice both forms. Guadalupe okay. and Monica. Mm -hmm. The question. You at the cinema yesterday? No, I'm not. Um, no, I wasn't. Um, I, I wasn't. I wasn't. Mm -hmm. No, I wasn't. Um, Rina, where were you? Oh, yes. the same question. Mm, the next question. Helena, um, were you in a car at 7 a.m. yesterday? Yes, I was in my car no, 7 a.m. yesterday. Simply say yes, I was or no, I wasn't, okay? And then you can give details. Okay. So yes, Short I was. answer. Short form. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, I was. I yes, was I was. My phone because la la la, but additional details after the answer. Ah, okay. Okay, thank you. Yes, I was because I I go to the bus of go. I just went. Yes, everything is in the past right now. Everything. Okay, I went to the seven a.m. yesterday. Was in a car. Where were you? Were you? In, in, in a car at 7 a.m. yesterday? 7 a.m. Yes. 7 a.m. Connect 7 a.m. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. Uh -huh. And the answer is yes, I was, or no, I wasn't. And then okay. the details, yes, I was, because I had to go to la la la, but say yes, I was, no, I wasn't. And then details. Okay. Yes, I was. Yes, I was because I went to. How do you say? They had a. They had a meal. Okay. Drop pick off. Up is pick like, up. Right. Drop off. No, drop pick up. Off. Drop. Drop, drop, drop up. Drop off. Off. Drop up. Drop off. <laughs> off. Off. <laughs> off. No, no, I was. I was. We was. We weren't. Yeah, we no, were. There you go. What I didn't see. It. What? what time? Time to finish, I guess. <laughs> oh. You finished the questions already? Yes. Yeah. One second. But you, I don't know, you finished all the questions already? Uh, me, we have yeah. like, Yes. All all the question we we 
we have done. Okay, great. We're gonna go back then. Okay. Welcome back. Okay, now I guess that hi, <laughs> hi, hi again. Hi. <laughs> I think you're more familiarized with the structure okay. now, right? The structure of the question was she, where you. I hope it is at least. Tomorrow we're gonna continue practicing this topic. Meanwhile, I'm interested in knowing some of these questions. So, guys, simply say yes, I was, or no, I wasn't. Everybody, unmute the microphone, even if it's noisy. It's okay. All right, it doesn't matter. So, simply say yes, I was, no, I wasn't. No details. All right, because I want to ask everybody the question. So, guys, were you at the beach yesterday? No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. I wasn't. No, 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 nobody. Okay. okay, were you at home all day yesterday? No, I was no, no, I no. Yes, it was. Oh, only Mauricio. <laughs> <laughs> what day? Oh, Monday. No, no, no. Never. Unmute the microphone and participate. Gabriela, hold on. I unmuted you, Gabriela. No, Oscar. Okay. Were you at the cinema yesterday? No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. I know what question you're going to say yes to. Were you at work yesterday? <laughs> yes, I was. <laughs> Everybody will say yes. Okay. Were you at school at 8 a.m. yesterday? No, I was. No, I was. No, I was. At 8 a.m.? 8 a.m. I think that we are too old to be in the school. <laughs> but you know what? It's a common thing to say. Like, I personally say I have to go to school. I have to go to the university or to college. I say the school. So it's, it's common to call it school. We are in a kind of school, online school, huh? Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> online class, my online class. <laughs> Okay, were you happy yesterday? Yeah. yeah. Yes, I was. Yes, yes I was. Yes, 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 today. Were happy. You, forever. Were you stressed today? <laughs> During the day? Were you stressed today? Yes, I was. No, I was. <laughs> no, I was. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. <laughs> Relax, guys. No, I was. <laughs> you're gonna be. You're gonna get old. We're gonna age quickly. Okay, and were you asleep yesterday at 10 p.m.? Yes, yes, I was. Yes, yes, I yes, was. I was. After this class. Yes, I was. Aha. Uh -huh, exactly. <laughs> 9 p.m. <laughs> I went to no, bed at 10 a.m. <laughs> Nine p.m. Wow. Three. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, that was interesting. Thank you very much for joining us tonight. It was a pleasure seeing you, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. 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 See you tomorrow. Bye. Good evening. Bye. Good evening. Good evening. Bye. 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 Bye.